Okay, this is Dan for August 23rd, 2018. This is video number 16. Um, pretty much what you guys all see is what I have here. I mean, with the camera. Basically, this is all I have so far. Um, I did sell my gold coin, you know, in my spending, and I've been watching... Uh, I can't pronounce their names, kind of funny names, but one of them said, you know, don't go hog wild, and I guess I, it was an addiction for me, buying the silver. And even though I'm positioned to buy a lot, I overspent, and I sold the gold coin, but I paid $130 for it. I made $3 profit, but because I shipped it priority, I lost $10. So, it, it served a purpose. I actually paid my cable bill. That was my main concern. But, I was able to sell a bunch of stuff that I didn't use. That was just sitting around. And, this, this desk here is kind of small, as you can see. Um, that's going to change next, next week. I'm going to be ordering a bigger desk with a lot more... A new chair the chair I got I've had for two and a half years it's time to get a new one but the desk is, is most important it's cramped and I want a big wide disc this is 20 23 inches in length width wise the new desk I'm getting is gonna be 30 so that, that gives me a lot more room to work with plus it's this is I'm not sure but it's not very big uh, the new desk will be 65 inches wide, so that's a big improvement, and i um, going to have a new light. I'm also going to kind of curtail my coin collecting for the next couple of months, because I'm gonna, going to, I decided to go ahead and build my um, new PC, but I also have a plan. Um, I got some DVDs. I'm going to actually sell them on eBay single because I tried to sell the whole package of like 160 of them and they were gifted to me so I don't really watch those kind of movies but still it's free money for me and so that's my project I'll be selling those and it's potentially lucrative you know but anyway that will actually that's not what I'm going to use to build a new PC Actually, I'm going to use the profits from that to buy my first half ounce gold. Now, if I can swing a whole ounce, I might. Depends how this, I mean, I'm a pretty good seller on eBay. I've sold over $472 worth of stuff, but that's that, and this is here. So, I got a new stuff today. This is from the profits of my, uh, my selling, um, even though I sold the gold, you know, it seems like I can't hold on to gold for very long, it seems, but my silver, I don't touch it. Um, I guess because gold is more liquid. Like some guy said, well, I had a, a dip into it, and I guess you might say I had to do the same. If I had uh, paid my bills first and then have whatever I have left over, I would have had the gold coin, but you know, it wasn't really heavy, and I'm looking for a heavy coin, say uh, 0 0.1 something, or even 2, so I'm going to be careful here, because I cut myself last time, and basically I scored pretty big, uh, silver.com, I will put that in the description, they have a pretty good sale on commemorative coins even though the commemorative they are legal tender but they are silver also I think they're 90% silver so and that's the trouble with this camera it's a Samsung and it's not I have to adjust it here so there okay well let's kind of get this all right, so now we got that straight. Now let's open the box. Like I said, I scored pretty good. I got silver this time when it was, uh, at least for the commemorative coins, I didn't have a lot to spend, but what I did spend, I got a pretty good deal. I paid $15.04 per coin 
that was I mean they're selling it for fourteen sixty at the time. So the total price for each coin was uh fifteen oh four I think and I bought uh another coin uh it's all silver and I love these things. There's one there's two and the third one is this. I don't have a case for it, but okay. Total damage on the price here is thirty dollars for these two. Uh, yeah, these two right here for thirty dollars. Basically, it breaks down to fifteen dollars four cents each. And this is a Mexican Le oh, Libertar. Libertab, I think. It uh, was $19 even. So you kind of have to watch the, on silver.com. Uh, it was uh, $49 plus $4.95, which equals $54.09. But anyway, I got two different two different ones this time. As you can see, uh, silver.com puts these in these little cases, which I'm glad they do. Um, and they are Lego tender. They're just commemoratives. Uh, I don't think they make these anymore. But as you can see, it will hold them. There you go. It's all silver, one ounce. But I paid a pretty good price, fifteen oh four total for each one. And let's look at the back. Uh, but I'm going to be selling on eBay, so I'm not really going to have time to do videos like this. But when I get a chance, I will, if I buy some more silver or if I attempt to buy some gold. Uh, it's been a couple of weeks since I've done videos, so. Anyway, you can see these are really nice. I like how silver.com puts them in these little capsules. I, that way I don't have to go out looking and searching and buying. Usually I buy the wrong ones. I try to figure out the size of these. Anyway, that just adds to my collection here. And this little guy. I wanted the gold version, but of course I can't afford it. Not right now. And I was thinking, well, at $1,200, that seems like I have a lot of money to spend for one coin. So I think if, you know, if I do make enough money out of it, here it is. Uh, it's Mexican, it's silver, and it's really nice. This is the uh, Libertar. Mexican uh, one ounce silver and as you can see I'm not sure what year 2018 this beautiful coin with the angel she ain't got no top on but that's all right it's a statue um, uh, overlooking I guess in Mexico somewhere in Mexico but I wish I could have got the gold version but this is my first Mexican coin one ounce silver strange how it doesn't say pure well, wait, wait a minute. Yeah, it does. Right there, 999. Let's get a closer look. Anyway, it's, it's, a, it's too sm small. There you go, 999 silver. Anyway, I'm happy what I got. And I've been watching uh, gold and silver drop again. Uh, silver dropped 20 cents this morning. But I had already bought these. So... These three here are my new addition. So I can just keep adding to my collection. As slow as it may be. You know, um, I love gaming, but at the time, you know, this takes precedence over gaming anytime. But my goal is to still save 1,000 ounces. So I need to upgrade my desk and chair and uh, get me a new printer so all these things add up so there's not much left over for any silver or gold but certainly i'm hoping to do another video soon within a couple of weeks well this is dan for my silver and gold collection for august 23rd 2018 and if you like the video please give me a thumbs up or thumbs thumbs down if you guys uh 
want to suggest what I should get next. Uh, a quarter ounce of gold, a half ounce, one ounce. I, you know, the, the one ounce is kind of debatable. You know, when you got 1200 bucks in your pocket, do you really want to buy just one coin? So give me some feedback on the, in the comments section. And I will put uh, silver.com as a link so you all can check out the prices on some of the... Some of the stuff is, is cheaper than others, but, you know, you got to do your pricing and shopping. Anyway, thanks for watching my video. I uh, hope to do another one soon.